Hi guys, welcome to the Code Punkers Den. Today we're going to learn how to install Facebook's HHVM or Hip Hop Virtual Machine and make it work together with the fast CZI module in Apache. Uh, basically what is going to happen is Apache will be handling all of the static content and we will let HHVM do what it does best, handle PHP or hack. Uh, for those of you who don't know this, uh, HHVM is a super fast way of interpreting PHP. Uh, what HHVM does is it compiles PHP code into a bytecode language, very close to native code, and stores it into an SQLite database. Uh, all of these things will make your, uh, your brand new website super fast. First things first, let's head over to DigitalOcean and create a brand new server. Uh, I'm not sure if you're aware of this, but it only costs $5 a month, so I think it's your best option for hosting your website currently on the market. Okay, uh, let's start by instantiating uh, a new server, a new virtual machine. Um, I'm just going to type in a host name like codebunker.any and I'm going to choose this package, uh, 512 megabytes of RAM, uh, one CPU, 20 gigabytes of SSD disk, uh, it only costs, as I said, $5 a month. And we're going to choose Ubuntu, the version right here, 13.10, 64 bits. Okay, and clicking create droplet, it only takes about one minute to do this. Here it is. Your new droplet is created, codepunker.any. Uh, guys, don't bother hacking into this. I, I will be deleting this droplet one the once the tutorial is over. I am going to be using uh, my regular SSH client for connecting to this brand new droplet on DigitalOcean. Perfect. So I'm now logged in as root. Let's start by installing Apache and MySQL so that we can start running our website. Uh, what's great about Ubuntu is it has this great package manager called Task Cell and in order to have uh, a running web server all you need to do is to type in Task Cell install LAMP server LAMP comes from Linux, Apache, MySQL, and PHP. And in a few moments, we should have all that we need. It asks me for a password for the root user. This time, I'm just going to use 123. Please don't do that at home. And again, 123. And we're done. Once the installation of uh, the LAMP server is done, we should be able to see uh, our website in the browser by accessing that IP that I received from uh, DigitalOcean. Yep, that's it. We have a running server. If you go in and edit with your um, SFTP client or anyway, if you used to using VI or Nano, you can edit it right from the console var www.index.html. This is the file that shows up in the browser. Let's edit this, delete all of the stuff that's in here, and we're going to type a basic PHP script that is PHP info and I'm saying write and quit and then we need to rename that file to a PHP file because it's now an HTML file and we're going to rename it by typing in the MV as in move and let's see we should be now seeing the PHP info file Okay, so now that we have our Apache server with PHP up and running, we're gonna need to install the Hip Hop Virtual Machine. Uh, 
in order to do that I'm going to type in some commands which you will be finding in the blog post uh, linked in the description of this video so um, you can go ahead and just click on uh, that link and you will find all of the commands needed to properly install HHVM uh, I'm just going to copy paste them as well the repos are updated and let's type in apt get update and then apt get install HHVM once HHVM is installed in order to make it run together with Apache and practically skip PHP HHVM is installed here are some more things you might want to do configure your web server to use HHVM and in order to do that all you need to type down is user share HHVM install fast CZI SH and that's what we're going to do I'm just going to copy and paste this and click OK and this has just created uh, my brand new server with Facebook's HHVM if I click reload right here uh, where the PHP info was uh, previously as you can see I now get hip hop and if I look at the network for this you will see that uh, in the X powered by header we have HHVM version 3.0.1 which is awesome uh, one more thing guys let's now uninstall uh, PHP we don't really need it anymore so what I'm going to do is say app get remove sorry remove everything that's PHP and click enter and we're removing PHP right now because we don't really need it anymore now we have a running server with uh, hip hop virtual machine coming from Facebook which runs a lot faster than regular PHP thank you so much for watching this video guys and don't forget visit uh, codebunker.com and start learning how to code bye bye